Salesforce report groupings by date. Let's jump in and talk about how we can group reports by week, by month, by year. So here we are, I'm gonna go ahead and navigate to a report here in Salesforce. I'm gonna go ahead and create a new report. And for this report, let's go ahead and make it an opportunities report. Now, in order to group by calendars, I'm gonna need a, a different date field in the group rows column. And so I'm gonna go ahead and put in close date. And I'm gonna make sure that all my filters are open so I can see all of these fun opportunities. And so here I have, you'll notice that there's you know, selected dates that it's grouping by, but I want to make sure that it's grouped by calendar weeks or months. And so how to do that is actually in this edit view, if I hover over this close date, which is now a grouped row, I can now group date by week, month, quarter, even year. So if I do that by calendar month, you'll notice here that those all change to Mark, March of 2020, and there's some January ones. And so just to show how that looks visually, is now it's showing as here, it's showing it by month. If I were to go ahead and change that to, let's say group by, let's go ahead and group this by week. You'll now notice that it's showing different weeks that these close dates are appearing. Uh, and so, so on and so forth, uh, I can go ahead and do that all the way down to even calendar year as these are all in uh, different years here. So here we have calendar year, it's gonna show 2020, 2023, 2024. And so just like that, you can group and make sure that you're grouping by certain date ranges. Uh, and those are the out of the box date ranges that come here uh, that you're able to. Now it's important to note that if I were to try and run this report, now I'm not able to group the column by this field, right? It has to be done in the edit view. So again, make sure that whatever field that you want to group by, you add it to the grouped row and then go ahead and group the date by any time allotment. Uh, and so just like that, you can have very digestible and important reports ready for you and the team. Thanks, and let me know if you have any other questions.